Yeah, good morning, guys. Mike Rick at 113. You know, when you get an all mode, all band radio, all mode meaning like, you know, you're on two meters and it does sideband, upper sideband, CW, things like that. You think there's going to be a lot of people out there? Maybe there are. Maybe I just don't have the right equipment yet. Uh, just using a vertical about 30 feet up. And I have made contacts even when the antenna was uh, 15 feet up over in New Jersey and area and things like that. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. It's just, uh, you think you'd hear more people out there, but I think a lot of folks, when they get their license, they're just using HTs or mobiles and they're sticking an FM on two meter. And that's what it is. I just heard a couple of voices out there in the ether. And once again, I know I am on the wrong polarization. They're using horizontal Yagi's beams, uh, maybe cross polarized antennas, which are Yagi's as well. Uh, and I'm using a vertical, but you should still be able to hear them, uh, just not as strong. And like I said, usually when you go from, uh, let's see here, a vertical antenna to a horizontal antenna, the other station, meaning if I'm transmitting on a vertical antenna, you're basically losing 20 dB of uh, power, pretty much. Not power, but uh, audio uh, when you... Uh, transmit vertically on sideband it's not like 11 meter where it doesn't really matter if you're working a skip station across the country or halfway across the country whatever uh, uh if you're vertical they're horizontal it really doesn't matter because the the wave gets you know flipped pretty much for lack of a better word uh on the ionosphere when it gets reflected off the ionosphere so it really doesn't matter there for skip on say HF bands, but over on two meter and 70 centimeter, even six meter for that matter, uh, it may make a difference. So, uh, you know, it is what it is, but, uh, one of these days I'll have the gear for that. You know, we're in the planning stages for, uh, we're doing two meter side band. So we will figure that out eventually, but until then we're going to keep listening. Yeah, all I hear is static. <laughs> Now, 144-200 is the calling frequency for sideband. Some people just have conversations right off of that at 205, 210. Um, I don't think there's, there's a birdie right there. So, yeah, you know, it is what it is. But I heard a couple of voices there right before I turned the camera on. <laughs> so, anyway, so we're still playing with the antenna. We're pretty happy with it so far. So good. Um, let's get out of this portion here. We'll switch the mode. And like I said, this is the, uh, Yesu FT991 Alpha. Uh, besides the ICOM 7100s, uh, one of the, oh, and the ICOM 705, I imagine. And that Yesu, uh, Yesu, uh, uh not Yesu. What do they call it? I call it Zygu. Everybody calls it something else. I guess it's the 6200 or whatever. Uh, they do all modal, all, all band. So there's your upper, lower side band, AM, FM, CW, ready, data, all that jazz. So I'm going to go back to FM real quick here, seeing that we're in two meter. So we've been experimenting with the, uh, the antenna a little bit here and there when we can. And I'm able to hear a lot more, so that's good. And I have been able to get into repeaters I have not been able to get into. So height is might as they say and uh that's great <clears throat> i'm really uh really enjoying that in that respect and uh yeah so we'll keep experimenting and we'll keep playing radio and i hope you guys have a great weekend i'll have some more video videos up <laughs> this weekend so uh don't forget to play radio toby says hi he's hiding behind that sticker there president <laughs> number one and uh, don't forget to play radio and, and have fun out there. This is Mike Cricket 113, 73 for now. Chat later.